Wanna Cry sounds like a Justin Bieber or an Enrique song, right? But it's actually a serious ransomware that has affected 150 countries over the weekend. And it's not that we haven't heard of this malware, it's actually the size that's unprecedented. And that's what the EU, that is the European Union police body, has been saying. Just to give you an idea, Renault has shut several French factories because of this ransomware. But let's take a step back and understand what is a ransomware. Imagine all your files are stolen and locked up. Now the culprits have the key and you will only get the key if you pay up in bitcoins, that is digital currency. The current ransom is 300 US dollars which is approximately 19,000 rupees and if you don't pay up in 3 days, they will ask you for 600 US dollars that is 38,000 rupees. I hate to say it but in India it is coming to a Windows device near you. Now if you are an Apple user, you are safe at the moment but if you are a Windows user and you haven't updated your security settings, especially if it's an old device, you're very vulnerable. In fact, the traces in India are out in Maharashtra and Gujarat but the state police are gearing up, they are setting up computer systems with antivirus and upgrading their Windows OS. So this morning there was an official briefing by the CERTN which is an emergency centre whenever there is a cyber attack saying on how to prevent the malware and what to do if it's already too late. Ransomware is a uh, malware that encrypts contents of infected systems and demands payment in uh, bitcoins. So far, this uh, impact of this ransomware has been reported is some of the hospitals in uh, England have been hit and uh, Russia, Spain, Frankfurt, USA and uh, academic institution China have been affected by this uh, ransomware. Mm -hmm. So what do you do when you need to prevent it? First, don't, don't click on any link that you find suspicious, even if you know the sender. Second, get yourself an offline backup, which means get yourself a hard drive and save all the data that you hold very close to you into that. So whether it's pictures, files, documents, Excel sheets, because it's affecting everything, especially the files that you use daily. Then there are patches from Microsoft called Security Bulletin MS17010 and some for unsupported versions like Windows XP, Vista, Server 2008. So what do you do if you are affected? First, don't pay the ransom. That's what CRT India is also saying. Don't pay the ransom, you're just encouraging them. CRT India has cleanup tools on their website. Run them. Immediately go offline, remove your device from there. Even if your data is encrypted, Save the data, there are new tools that will come in that will help you recover your data. Make sure you report your incident to CERT India. But the main thing that you will be worried about is your digital payments in Digital India. For this, the Ministry of Information and Technology are talking to NPCI, UIDAI and RBI to make sure digital payments in India are not affected. For more information on this ransomware, don't forget to check out gadgets360.com.